Hi, welcome back to my channel and today I've got another haul to show you guys. It is a River Island haul. Now I don't tend to shop at River Island um, but I'm a bit surprised. To me River Island is obviously a very very stylish place and it's one of those that a lot of the things in there are very risky for me so I don't tend to shop at River Island um, because I want to be a bit more safe. But recently I'm trying to step out of my comfort zone and try a different style of clothing. And if I like it, that's great. But if I don't, then at least I've tried it. So I've only got a few pieces to show you today, but um, the very most of them are a bit like out of my comfort zone. So yeah, I thought I'd share what I got. It's also a try on haul as well. I'm, I've got everything also in a size 12. Um, I'm a size 10 to 12, but because I didn't really know I don't really try River Island clothes that much. The only time I did was when I went in and tried the jeans and the size 12 fit me completely fine. So I went with size 12 with everything. Hoping obviously that it will fit really well. I've also tried all these clothes on already, um, but I will insert clips of me wearing them so you can see what they're like when they're on. But yeah, let's get started. So the first one I got was one of the most like comfort areas for me. Um, it's black, which I used to obviously love wearing. <laughs> Um, and it's this kind of little cute top and it kind of like goes in just underneath the bust and then it goes like out like a peplum is it? yeah like a peplum bottom it's okay I really really do like the shape and I really like the top but the sleeves were so annoying you'll see in a second for the try on clip but um, first I'll have to get rid of them because they do my head in but Every time I had it up, it just kept falling down. I think I needed to have sized down in this one to a size 10 because I think that's the reason why it is, it is a little bit big for me and that might be the reason why the shoulders are falling down all the time. So I think this one would probably be best but I needed a size 10 for it. Um, but I really like the style because it's kind of like the same type of the detailing around the boobs and stuff. I've, I've always loved the detailing around the boobs. But um, yeah, even that's a little bit baggy, but when I actually pulled it in, um, you'll see in a second, it looked loads better. So yeah, I think it's a downfall with this one that I just needed a size 10. Like I said, I am a size 12, but on the bottom half and usually a 10 at the top. So yeah, I think I did need a size 10. So this is the top. I am wearing the wrong bottoms with it. I would either wear like the dark denim skirt I have or like skinny jeans. Um, I don't know. I really don't know. I actually quite like this, I think. It's a really strange material, um, but it's slightly annoying. I mean, it's very low cut, and I kind of do love the shape to it. It's these sleeves, um, they are ruched, but um, yeah, they don't sit on me properly. Look, if I pull it down as much as I can, my boobs are slightly on show, but like, do you know what I mean? I kind of, with kids, and then that's going to annoy me sticking out every time I do it. So I do like it. I think just the sleeves are annoying. And I can't have them down right now. The next top I've got is this gorgeous polka dot one. I absolutely love the way this one sits and fits. Again, I could have sized it down to a size 10. Um, but I think I can still get away with a size 12. It doesn't look overly big. But it's just that when it, like, in size 10, it would look a bit more fitted. Especially, like, again, the detail around the boobs. That would look a bit better when it's more fitted. But... It's really nice and I love that kind of like the, the detailing of the frills and stuff on the sleeves and around the bottom and again I love ruchy when it comes around the boobs for some strange reason I think it, you look better with it and then it's got like a little tie bit here and then you've got buttons all the way down. I can actually get in this without undoing any of the buttons so that's when it usually shit, like tells me that I needed to size down um, but yeah it's really nice I've not really got anything with polka dots on um, yeah, I've got a couple of things in this haul with polka dots on. But um, yeah, I do like that and I do like the colours as well. This is the next top. Um, it fits quite nice actually, but I think I think I could get away with size 10 at the tops. Um, just like that other black one. Um, this one goes nicer with this skirt. Um, yeah, I like all kind of like the frills and I always love this type of like ruching on the boobs because I think it makes your boobs look amazing. So if it was a little bit tighter, I could have like, it would have fit me a little bit better on the boobs, but it's kind of slightly baggy and I mean it's got buttons all the way down the back as well to get in and I didn't have to undo any of the buttons to get in, I just pulled it over my head. So uh, yeah, 
probably could have done with sizing down, but I love the little frill detail. Um, yeah, I just might have to get this one in the size um, smaller. Seeing that though, if I get it in a size smaller, that's the problem I always have. It might be too tight in my stomach. But I have to see. But I do really like this top, it's really pretty. Right, the next one I've got is a bodycon dress. I have not got the body, in my opinion, <laughs> to wear a bodycon dress. Um, I tried one um, a few weeks ago with um, an ASOS haul, which I'll link in the description, and it just went terribly wrong. It didn't even fit me. It was just too tight. But this top, this haul so far, obviously everything I could have sized down to a size 10. So I've got size 12 in this dress, and it's really nice. I love kind of like the pattern and the style of it, but obviously it's a bodycon dress. It did fit me, and it fit quite nice. Um, it weren't too tight at all. I think that's because obviously I could have sized down to a size 10, but I felt comfortable in a size 12. Um, the buttons are fake, which is great because I hate when it's tight and the buttons give a bit and the pull. I don't like that. Um, but yeah, it fits quite nicely. Um, from the front it looks okay, it's just when I turn to the side. I don't like my stomach area, my, my hip area. Um, I could have got away with it if I wear like the big, kind of, obviously the tummy control pants, but they, I, I can't wear them. So, I just prefer to wear things I'm comfortable wearing. So yeah, I got this in a size 12 and it's so pretty. This one's also got the price on as well and it was 30 pounds, but I think I'm gonna be sending this back. I don't know why I keep doing this to myself and all the body congresses, but I do quite like it. It's just, I don't like um, wearing the tummy control pant things because I have a lot of like upper back issues, like shoulders and neck pain. And if I wear a strapless bra, it makes it pain worse and if I wear the pant things they hurt my stomach because I don't have the good like the best digestion and uh, it, that causes pain as well but this is another body congress but I thought because it looks a little bit different like with the buttons and stuff I'll try it and uh, I actually do quite like it I don't think I'm going to keep it because it's still too much around here to show on my hips and stuff but it is a nice dress. If I was a little bit more confident, I probably could have got away with it, but no, I think I'm gonna send it back. It's really nice and stretchy. So uh, the other bodycon dress, if you don't know, I'll pop the link in the description of the video um, when I did my ASOS haul. I couldn't even put it on. Um, but this one, it is nice. Um, and I think from the front, it doesn't look so bad. I just don't like it when I turn. I just won't be comfortable in it, but. I'm glad I kind of tried it though, because it is a really, really pretty dress. And I love kind of like the pattern and the detail on it. It's really nice. This was one of my risky things. I got it because I thought, hmm, it's got a lot of in things for summer. Um, for example, it is a beautiful pink. And then you've got your yellow detail on there as well. And yellow is very big for summer. And then it's got loads of frills, which is kind of like the in thing for summer. Um, the buttons and it's just so pretty because it is a sheer dress you do actually get a slip with it where it's actually separate a really pretty lilac slip that you put on underneath so that came as always like a two set and as soon as I tried it on I was just like that looks so pretty but it's just too I don't know if it's just too much so if you can let me in the comments know what you think um, that would be great this one's not got a tag on, so I can't tell you the price of this one. But, um, yeah, it's really, really pretty, but it's just, I don't know if it's just a bit too much. You'll see in the triangle anyway, but I think if it would have no sleeves and the frill would have ended here, I think it would probably be a bit better. Um, it's just really pretty on. You'll have to see, like a proper, like, Victorian style dress. Um, but yeah, I'll need your opinion on that one. So this is one of the dresses. Um, I mainly got this one because I know yellow is kind of like the in thing at the minute. I really like it. I didn't think I was going to. I just kind of got it because I thought, oh, I wanted to try more risky things. So I kind of got a couple of safe things, which would have been a dark top really. But um, I got a couple of safe things. Um, like I said, would have been with that black top even though it's weren't really safe for me now for trying it on but <laughs> I wanted to get out of my comfort zone but this is just 
so pretty. I love kind of like the old Victorian style dresses. Um, it's so pretty, but is it me? That's my problem because I absolutely love it and I'd love to wear it, but I just don't know if it's just too much. Um, maybe if it didn't add sleeves. <laughs> and like the end, the sleeves ended here. That might have been a little bit better, but I really do like it. I mean, with the sleeves as well. I just don't know if it's just too much for me. I love the fact that you've got a separate, like you have got a lay, underlay to it, um, an underdress. But it's just a shame that it didn't attach. Like usually the, the ones I get with underdresses, they have kind of like a little hook, like hoop thing to attach them. Or you can like cut it off if you don't want them attached. But um, it is really nice. I think again, I think I do. I think I could get away with getting the size down in this and actually getting the size 10 because I um, mean, there's quite a lot of thing there. And if I did make it a little bit tighter, it would be a little bit more fitted. Um, it's quite nice and still comfortable. It's not like too big. I don't know. I think I need help with this one. Um, comment down below what you think because it's a very, very pretty dress. But I just don't know if it's just too much. Like, is the pattern, I mean, if it was a plain colour with all this, I think I'd like it more. Um, but I think because it's got the ruffles, the buttons, and then you've got this pattern. Oh, I don't know. It's the same again, maybe if you didn't have sleeves. I really, I'm really unsure about this one. Because I didn't think I'd actually like it, but I really, really do like it. So please comment down below um, if you think I should keep it or not. Or if it's just way too much. Because these are sheer sleeves, so it won't be too warm to wear in the summer at all. Um, or it could even be like going away, uh, wear, like a going away outfit you can wear at night time. But yeah, let me know what you think in the comments. Right, so the last and final one I got is another risky thing. I think everything in this one is pretty much a risky thing. Is a, um, like a jumpsuit? Yeah. Um, well, not a jumpsuit. I've got what it's called. Um, <laughs> basically, um, this here. It is, um, it looks, it's quite big at the bottom where it kind of comes out. So it actually looks like a skirt, but it's not. They are actually shorts. Um, Again, it's polka dot, which is not really a thing I tend to go for, but polka dot's in. I think it's always in polka dots. And then it's green, which is a new colour that I'm trying to kind of get into. Um, it's nice. It is a size 12. And it was £46, so it's very, very pricey. Um, but I quite like it. It's, I'm still slightly unsure about it, so I probably will have to send it back. Because that's one thing that I keep on thinking now, I'm only going to keep things that I absolutely love. That's why I'm torn between that purple dress because and the other dress. I'm like, I really do love it. But, yeah. But yeah, this one. Um, yeah, it's nice and it fits really well. I could not have sized down in this because of the bottom half where the shorts were. They're like the band that goes just above my hips. I could not have gone like, to a size 10 with that one. So I'm glad I ordered a size 12. And then you've got like a... Um, these that you can just tie, I'm assuming they're tying around the back, which is what I tied them anyway, because at the front you've got your buttons, which are fake, um, the fake buttons, but then you've got a zip that goes all the way down the back, like, pretty much all the way down, it ends here, and then that's where it ends, uh, that's the rest of the shorts. So it's really easy to get in, and it's really, really comfy, but, yeah, I don't think it's for me. So this one is definitely another risky one for me, um, being a play suit, oh, I really like the sleeves. Um, and it's green. It's the colour that I'm getting into. Um, I like the layering of it because I was hoping with the layering of it it kind of like had me mum to a bit, which I'm hoping it does. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's kind of like it's a play suit, but I like the fact that it's all kind of like thing at the bottom, so it kind of looks like a dress. Um, completely different for me, but it is really, really pretty. Definitely kind of sized down on this one. This is a size 12. And, and although at the top it is a little bit big, the bottom I wouldn't want it any tighter. Probably could have got away with it. Well, no. Even a little bit tighter. I'd have struggled with this band here, I'd struggle with. Um, 
but yeah I do like it just feel sure about this one as well like I'm trying to kind of like step out my comfort zone and trying to get away with wearing a play suit but one that I feel comfortable in um so yeah let me know what you think of this one as well that is everything I got for this River Island haul. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Like I said, I've tried different things. There is obviously a few things that I liked in this haul that I probably wouldn't have liked on the hanger and I would have thought, no, it's not for me, but I'm glad I tried them because, yeah, I'm trying to set out my, step out of my comfort zone at the minute with different style fashions, colours, patterns and things like that. So, yeah, I really, really liked some of the pieces that I got today. But if you've enjoyed it, please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. I'm a mum of two, to Andrew who is seven and Ava who is four. I upload videos about fashion, beauty, lifestyle, motherhood, hauls, cleaning, everything basically. So if it's something you're interested in watching, don't forget to subscribe and also press that bell. I upload videos on a Monday, Wednesday, Thursday and a Saturday at 6pm. But I hope you have an amazing rest of the day and I will see you soon. Bye.